Hey Gemini, rising storm here. So I'm going to be doing a general love reading for the month of May. Keep in mind that these are general readings. Take what applies. Feel free to switch your storylines however you like, all right? So I'm going to be looking to your overall view, your energies, Gemini, the person that you're dealing with, right? Why is it all happening and the possible outcome for now until the end of May 2022? What is going on with Gemini and the person that they're dealing with, please? Give me an overall view, your energies, Gemini, the person that you're dealing with. Why is it all happening? Possible outcome here, okay? What is going on, Gemini? All right. So the overall view is the Five of Swords in reverse. So it's like wanting to reconcile, all right? Oh, so. Ugh, what in the world? So maybe the overall view, somebody here could have been playing a lot of mind games, all right? But there's this energy of wanting to reconcile, wanting to come out of that energy, all right? Let's see what's going on. Show me this five of swords in reverse. What is this five of swords in reverse about? Yeah, and somebody here definitely feels like there's uh, unfinished business or lack of closure between the two of you. And it's kind of like wanting to reconcile or wanting to get to a better space or a better state between the two. So it's like unfinished business, feeling like things are not finished yet, a lack of closure as well for some of you. Give me the one with the Sagittarius. Show me this Nine of Cups. What is this Nine of Cups about? Show me the Nine of Cups. So even though this, this is someone, I feel like they are your wish fulfillment or they fulfill you emotionally here but it's kind of like there's a lot of stagnancy right now or no no one's really doing much when it comes to this connection i feel like you're still hurt about whatever it is that happened with this person uh i don't know um show me the three of swords what is this three of swords about show me the three of swords yeah and the temperance card so it's kind of like you still are very much you see this person as your wish fulfillment, but at the same time, there's a lot of stagnancy. There's nothing moving forward, okay? You could be dealing with the Pisces. I got cancer here as well. But at the same time, it's like you're you're hurt. You're hurt. You're still hurt by whatever it is that was revealed or whatever it is that was known here. I think, uh, um, show me the temperance. Show me the temperance card. Clarify the temperance. I feel like you're trying to heal about whatever it is that happened between the two of you there was some sort of ending or some sort of betrayal that happened that you're still very much stuck on or you're still very much hurt by and it's like you're not doing anything about it or you're not trying you're not really doing much with that hangman there even though a part of you still feels a, a, an emotional attachment to this person i think you're in this energy of trying to heal this though it's like you're trying to heal this you're trying to let this go excuse me um why is the moon in reverse here? Show me the moon in reverse. Show me the moon in reverse, please. <laughs> so whoever this is, I think this is someone who definitely wants to come out of the of of the fact that you guys are not speaking. So this is someone who definitely wants to come out of no communication, but at the same time they they're the ones who are very guarded. I don't know why. So they're coming across as someone who's very guarded, who has their walls up, all right? They're acting like they're not as attached to this like they once were or they used to be. Show me the devil in reverse. You could be done with the Capricorn. Show me the devil in reverse. What is this devil in reverse about? I think this is someone who definitely show me the moon card show me the moon what is this moon in reverse about there's 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 i think there there could have been like a third party situation here i feel like your person definitely wants to communicate with you or they definitely wanting to come out of this period of no communication but that at the same time they're coming across as someone who's very guarded very closed off as well it could have been revealed that there could have been a third party situation or somebody else involved. But they're the ones acting like they're 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 guarded or closed off. 
this is someone who um they're acting like they're not as attached to the situation or they're letting this go but in reality i feel like they still feel that connection here there's way too many people in in this in in, in this situation here it kind of looks like you're just trying to heal and this person they they got there's just so much going on show me the lover's card show me the lover's card what is this lover's about yeah, and they're not communicating with you. So it's like, um, they're keeping their distance as well. I don't know why, but they're coming across as if they're the victim, all right? They're, they're, they're coming across as if, you know, they're the ones that are guarded or, you know, but in, re in reality, there could have been things that were known or a third person could have been revealed in regards to the situation. Could have been a toxic situation as well for some of you. I don't know. The cherry and reverse for why it's all happening. It could be dealing with the cancer. It doesn't have to be, but it's stagnancy, a lack of forward movement, a lack of forward movement, nothing happening. Show me this cherry and reverse. What is this cherry and reverse about? Yeah. So it's kind of like wanting to wanting to work on things, but not really moving forward. All right. Or not moving past this. Um, how does Gemini see this person? What can you tell me? How does Gemini see this person? You see them as someone who's sneaky as fuck. All right, you see this. You see this person as someone who's very sneaky, very deceptive. Okay, ha tells half truths or keeps secrets. All right, tell me about the Seven of Swords. What is the Seven of Swords about? And yeah, you f you see this person as someone who had a third party situation, or there was some sort of sneakiness in regards to a third party. It's what it keeps saying. So you see this person as someone who's shady, who's deceptive, who has third party situations going on, all right. But for some reason, I'm getting the energy from your persons, and they're coming across as if they're the ones that are guarded, or they play victim. How does this person um? How does this person see Gemini? What can you tell me? How does this person see Gemini? They see you as someone who's not reaching out to them. Why the page of why the page of wands in reverse? Why the page of wands in reverse? They see you as someone who might not be interested in not not be interested in them anymore. They see you as someone who's not really reaching out to them. They they feel like you're not reaching out. Why the four cups? It's kind of like they, they see you as someone who's realized, you know, that they are a player or they're, that they're deceptive, all right? And they, they see you as someone who probably isn't, wouldn't want to be interested in them anymore. It's like the truth was revealed or the truth came out or was known. All right, so what actions will Gemini be taking towards this person, if not yet already, please? What can you tell me? What actions will Gemini be taking, if not yet already? The King of Cups. Why the King of Cups? Why the King of Cups? And the Knight of Pentacles. But you still have a lot of feelings for this person. I feel like maybe at... I feel like you, if you are going to eventually, you know, express your feelings towards this person. Okay. If not yet, or I don't know what this is trying to say. It's like um, you're going to be trying to express your feelings. Why the Knight of Pentacles? But at the same time, it's like you're still holding on to whatever it is that happened in the past. So it's kind of like you're, you're still going to be trying to express your feelings or trying to take things slow with this person. But at the same time, it's like you, you're aware that what they've done in the past. What? What actions will this person be taking towards Gemini? What actions will this person be taking towards Gemini, please? The Ace of Wands in reverse. Don't chase this person. Why is the Ace of Wands in reverse for? Why the Ace of Wands in reverse? And the Six of Pentacles there. <sighs> Their, their actions is a very start, like one minute you hear from them, the next minute you don't. It's a very start-stop connection. One minute, like they, they are, you hearing from them, the next minute you don't. 
Ace of Wands in reverse to the Six of Pentacles. So it's like one minute they are they're talking to you, the next minute they're not. You don't you don't hear from them. There's a lack of a new start. What's the possible outcome for the situation from now until the end of uh, May for this situation, please? What can you tell me? What's the possible outcome here for now until the end of May? Knight of Cups in reverse, being closed off emotionally. Why is this happening? The Seven of Wands, somebody here not fighting for this connection. Why the Knight of Cups in reverse? So it's like, even though there's not an offer to be had, there's this energy of having a hard time letting this go or energetically having a hard time letting this go. Even though somebody here is being very emotionally closed off. Show me the Page of Cups. What is this Page of Cups about? So, um, I feel like this could be a very on and off communication. Like one minute, like I said, one minute you, you, one minute there's an offer, the next minute there, one minute there's some emotions being expressed, the next minute there's no communication. It's a very on and off connection that keeps you kind of like hanging on. Why is that three of wands in reverse? What is this three of wands in reverse? Somebody here, I feel like the player is going to end up turning their back when it comes to this. Somebody, there's a player here. And it's like this person eventually, they're going to be turning their back to this connection. Why the Seven of Wands here in reverse? Yeah. Somebody here is just too set in their ways. And it's like they're it's like no one's really gonna be fighting for the connection. But at the same time, somebody here has a hard time letting go of this energetically or having a hard time letting this end. I'm getting that the player is the one the player is the one that's gonna end up turning their back. It could be a very on and off one minute you hear from them, the next minute you're not. Okay, this is what I'm getting. Um, so you could be dealing with an Aries. I got fire, Sagittarius, could be any sign, Pisces as well, alright? So that was your reading. If it resonated, please like share, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Bye.